guys catch us on the main channel or whatever hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel or whatever and today we're going to tobago so make sure to like comment and subscribe and let's get into the video okay so in this clip we're on the way to the port i was on about an hour of sleep because <clears throat> i did most of my packing <laughs> i did most of my packing like the night before <laughs> that took a while so i ended up taking a nap basically you can't even go to sleep in for real and then i went to pick up my friends i listen let me just talk what, this girl one of my friends we're not gonna name her right now but um <clears throat> i go to pick her up because we're gonna go meet somewhere else to pick up the other friend right so <laughs> i'm calling her her phone is on do not disturb i'm like oh my goodness gracious so and this girl is sleeping so i'm like oh my goodness <laughs> so i have to run go knock on her door be like girl get out <laughs> It was eventful. Then we got where we had to go, picked up my friend, our other friend, and then we went to the port. And we were like the first three people there. So that leads to the next clip. In this clip, I am doing my lip combo because <laughs> I'm doing my lip combo because I had no time to do that when I was leaving my house. So I was like, okay, we're the first three here. Let's just do this before, you know, everything wraps up and starts getting crazy. So yeah. friends are telling me that they weren't able to bring up a couple of the bags because they told them to leave them downstairs they're not grocery bags massy bags and they told them to leave them downstairs <laughs> this all of us fell asleep basically for most of the boat ride and then we got up and went outside to look at the view i was super scared of dropping my phone i was like if i drop my phone in that water no i would have no choice but to go after it and then would i survive going after it we don't know so <laughs> yeah i was like no i'm scared of dropping this so i got a couple clips but i didn't film too much there in this bag so I can change it. We're almost there. It's Vago. All of us woke up. We went outside. So 
now we're just kind of waiting to get to the port and move on to the next phase. Okay, so we're in Tobago. We literally just, I was gonna say landed, but no, we didn't land. We just docked and we got off the boat and we're going to Pigeon Point because our check-in time for the villa was like three o'clock. So we had some time to get, so we went straight to the beach with our bags and everything. Yeah. As you guys can see, we're on the beach, Pigeon Point. Welcome back to our little hut that we ended up getting because we still have all of our suitcases and everything. Like, literally, we're waiting for the guest house to be vacated <laughs> for check in time. That clip I was talking about the fact that we had a, a hut situation, and we did. We ended up renting one of them, I think it's like 170 TT or something like that to rent. I can't remember the exact figure, but it's around there and we ended up getting it for the time that we were there and it was good because we literally had all of our suitcases and bags and everything so it was great to have it in like a centralized spot plus the sun was hot so it gave us nice nice shade and i had like a little table and bench situation so it was nice this is me laying on the luggage because i was tired like i said i only got one hour of sleep so your girl was trying to take a nap. I probably did. Honestly, I'm not sure, but I did take a nap, I think.
okay this is the villa tour so it's kind of funny because i was just gonna do like mini room tours and a little walk through downstairs or whatever and then Anwar is like uh, let's do it like mtv like welcome to my crib so hence why Jaden and Anwar's room got like a little intro the rest of the rooms i just did like a thing but for their room they had an intro Welcome. So, we got room three, and honestly, I know I'm gonna sound biased, but must be real here. I think we had the best time. I really think we did. <laughs> We had so many good talks, laughs, we danced, <laughs> we really had a great time and the room itself, which I'm supposed to be talking about, was stunning. Like, the room was really nice and it fits us all comfortably, like we didn't have any issues in that regard. The villa on a whole was beautiful, the views phenomenal, the amenities 10 out of 10. Honestly. Yeah, it was giving what it was supposed to give. I was not disappointed at all. <laughs> guys so yes that was our room it was four of us and the room was me and the other friends it was very fun our room was definitely vibes <laughs> you know we'd have our late night chats but anyways the room itself was very nice spacious we each had our own like separate cupboard space the bathroom was lovely hot water i would recommend Then we ended up having a karaoke night that night. It was really spontaneous. I remember coming downstairs and I think like two people were downstairs, they're playing music and stuff. I was like, ooh, cause I was hearing like, I think I was hearing bachata or something like that. I was like, ooh, okay. And then somehow, I don't even know how it ended up becoming a karaoke night, but it did. And then we were singing, dancing. It was a great, great, great time. Okay, so the first night was pizza night. And I don't really know how it then became a karaoke and dance party but it did and i'm not mad at it we sang some of us crowed um <laughs> lots of us screamed and then they brought up kelsey and shola rivers if you know you know and i mean it was fun i had a lot of fun <laughs> but a lot of people are saying that that was the most jamaica they've seen me so but yeah, I had a good time. Oh, you know, for the late night vibes. Obviously, we all just, you know, land. <laughs> and so uh, we're just like, yeah, let's vibe. And we started playing some old school songs that we know. So old school R&B and singing along. That was very fun. That was very, very, very fun. <laughs> <laughs> It's perfect time. 
Is it yes? Más simétrica que un origami Eres perfecta mujer De la cabeza a los pies Nena, I got your baby Toma que tú besas, mami Más simétrica que un origami De la forma que tú besas, mami Más simétrica que un origami Amarte es mi mania Que lo que toca mi mano se daña Pero amor es lo que dicen Son por ahí todos y todas las poses que... After the karaoke night slash dance party situation, we ended up going in the pool and that water was cold. Very, very, very cold, but it was a lot of fun. <laughs> So that's it for this video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and look out for future content. Yeah, yeah.